Safira Pakistan. Program focus on the life and achievement of Pakistani American. Safira Pakistan. So I hope that when he goes there, he will thank people for their help. And I think he will try to make sure that people understand that we are trying to do what's best for everyone. Our last thing, I will ask you to give a message to the greater nation of India and Pakistan, okay, how the Indian Pakistani living in America, yes. how they're doing, how they're excelling, and how they're participating in invention and investment yes. and a business. Yes. And they are a great contributor in America. The uh, Southeast Asian community and the Indo-American communities have been one of the major forces, not only in California's economy, but in the nation's economy. The economy of America would not be today what it is if it hadn't been for the contributions made by the Pakistani, Indian, Southeast Asian, Indo-American people. The, the most uh, well-respected in finance in the academics, in business, in professions are the Southeast Asian and Indo-American communities. I'm frankly a little bit jealous because <laughs> we have not yet been able as a Latino community to be able to get as tremendous activities as you have been. But we're going to be moving quickly to try to catch up with you and we want to be able to be as great a con contributor as you have to our nation. Uh, Dr. Thana, you know that uh America is the land of opportunity. America is a place you have all kind of freedom, religion, race, color, the land of opportunity, the land for anybody. It's a melting pot from all over the world, people coming from Cambodia to Pakistan to India to China to Korea to Arabia to Africa, anywhere. Give me a little bit of your views about America as a country. Well, I mean, I, you know, it's 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 a phenomena in its own right. Uh, I mean, the United States is uh, um, not just a melting pot, really. It it, it um, in some ways, melting pot means you know everybody sort of blends in and becomes one. Uh, in many ways, America actually allows you to be the individual that you want to be, and express ourselves as individuals that we want to express ourselves, and. Um, Sometimes in other parts of the world, you don't have that freedom of expression. So that's probably the biggest quality in this country. And like any other place, you know, we have our shortfalls here and we have our strengths. So our goal should be to contribute further to strengthen uh, not only America, but America's relations outside with other parts of the world. Uh, we can be a good bridge, at least for us, you know, from the uh, Pakistani community to be a good bridge between the United States and Pakistan and uh, help that relationship foster and, and grow better. So we have a pretty important role here, you know. What do you think about uh, Islam in America? I mean, it, you know, Islam anywhere, really in some sense, you know, because right now the Islamic world is going through a lot of turmoil, a lot of um, inner uh, evaluations really need to be done for us, you know, as Muslims. Uh, we just had this uh, event with, uh, you know, uh, with people uh, having protested the drawings of the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam's uh, life uh, or, or his pictures, you know, but um, they, people get upset when drawings emulate the Prophet, uh, but they don't get upset when we in our lives don't emulate the Prophet. How do you analyze the contribution of the Pakistani American uh, Muslim in American economy, science, technology, medicine, as you are the one of the uh, entrepreneur and icon of the MRI trade and medicine? Um, I mean, I think we have made tremendous contributions. There's no doubt. I mean, you know, financially, um, the Pakistani Indian community in the United States is actually the richest minority in the United States. I don't know if a lot of people know that or not. Uh, but more than just money, you know, this community has, uh, you know, um, the most representation of physicians of any nationality uh, other than, um, you know, uh, Caucasian in this country. There's more Indian Pakistani physicians here than from any other part of the world. Uh, more scientists, more engineers. Um, we're lacking in lawyers, but I'm not sure if that's a good thing or a bad thing. <laughs> But um, overall, you know, I think we're contributing tremendously, and I think that uh, we'll continue to do so. 
and we will flourish, inshallah. Any method to the nation of Pakistan, people watching you in Pakistan? Well, well, you, you know. Method? Do you feel homesick? Do you feel... You know, I've grown, I've grown up here. Um, so, uh, I'm not sure if I'd say homesick, but I'll tell you that I really, really enjoy going to Pakistan a lot. And, uh, you know, it's, it's still the motherland. Um, and, um, you know, we feel very, very connected, very, very close to Pakistan and the Pakistani people here. Um, and, you know, we are Pakistanis in our heart, and we are Americans in our heart. So, you know, we're that bridge, really, between uh, Pakistan and the United States. Thank you very much, Dr. Sana Khan. My pleasure. Nice to see you again. Nadrin, I am with you, Mr. Najib Ghori, who is the CEO and Chairman of NETSOL International. They are also in operation in Pakistan and America. They are very successful. They are in operation. They are working very well for Pakistan. They are working very well for Pakistan. They are introducing Pakistan to America on the corporate level. I think that their contribution is capable of تحسین ہے اور یہ واقعی قابل تحسین ہے نجیب غوری and I'm taking this opportunity to talk several entrepreneur and today I have with me a real true American dream what do you think Pakistani American entrepreneur contribution in American economy thank you for your kind words I'm actually humbled Pakistan is at a cross point where Pakistan and youth relationship is significantly important for business, for commerce, for trade, uh, for our security. For myself, uh, a business that we started about 10 years ago, uh, Nestle Technologies, we've done Alhamdulillah quite well. Uh, we have raised significant amount of capital and invested in the Pakistan IT sector, in the economy, in the people, in the education. And this opportunity was given to me because I was living here and exploiting, exploring uh, the opportunities in Pakistan. अब ये जो ट्रिप आ रहा है प्रेसिडेंट बुश का हमारी बिजनेस काउंसिल यूएस पाकिस्तानी बिजनेस काउंसिल जिसका मैं नेशनल और माइस वादर वन ऑफ द फाउंडिंग मेंबर्स इट इज अ सिग्निफिकेंट ट्रिप इन माय बिलीफ दिस इज जस्ट टू शो गुड जेस्टर दैट आई रिलेशनशिप बिटवीन द यूएस एंड पाकिस्तान इज लॉन्ग टर्म बेस्ड नॉट ऑन ए शॉर्ट टर्म आई थिंक दिस विल हैव अ पॉजिटिव इफेक्ट फॉर आवर इकोनॉमी फॉर आवर यूथ फाइटिंग एक्सट्रीमिज्म टेररिज्म uh, we need to continue to improve the perception, the image of the Pakistani business uh, and econo e economy in the U.S. This perception to improve this trip, hai, in my view, is quite significant. And we should We should support it. We should acknowledge it. And inshallah, it will be benefit of this. We were immigrants from Pakistan, se, along with millions of others, who came here and have achieved a job. I have seen in اٹھائیس سالوں میں کہ یہاں پر اس سوسائیٹی نے ہمیں بڑا کچھ دیا اور بچوں نے تعلیم حاصل کی ہے ہر لحاظ کا فریڈم میں یہاں دیکھتا ہوں ریلیجن کا فریڈم ہے بزنس کا فریڈم ہے سپیچ کا فریڈم ہے آپ کچھ بھی کہہ سکتے ہیں اور بڑے سیول طریقے سے ہم لوگ یہاں پر جو بھی ایشیز ہوتے ہیں افیرز ہوتے ہیں اس کے مینج کرتے ہیں اب جہاں تک تعلق ہے پاکستان اور امریکہ کی فرنشپ کا اور یہ کہاں جا رہی ہے میرے لی تو اس سے بڑی اچھی بات کوئی نہیں ہے کہ امریکہ پاکستان اور بھی سٹرانگ اپنے آپ کو کریں کیونکہ اپنا ایک سیلفش انٹرس کہہ لیں کہ پاکستان کا پاکستان کی بہتری کے لیے میں سمجھتا ہوں کہ چونکہ ہمارا بھی پاکستان میں اچھا خاصا بزنس ہے فیملی ہے دوست یار ہیں اور پاکستان سے ہمارا بہت زیادہ اسوسیشن ہے ہماری تو یہ خواہش ہے لائک مینی ادر پاکستانی لیونگ ابراڈ کہ پاکستان جتنی جلدی اپنے پاؤں پہ کھڑا ہو جائے ہر لحاظ سے آگے بڑھے اکنامیکلی ایجوکیشن کے حساب سے غربت کے حساب سے وہ اس میں کمی آئے تو میں سمجھتا ہوں کہ یہ ریلیشنشپ جو ہے پاکستان کی امریکہ سے بڑی سٹرانگ ہے اور ٹائمنگ اس کی بڑی چھئی ہے it's a very pivotal stage of Pakistan in my view اور اس کی وجہ یہ ہے basic وجہ یہ ہے کہ I have lot of praises for the President Musharraf's leadership and Prime Minister Shaukazi's leadership جو انہوں نے مل کے ایک decision لیا تھا کہ اس جو جو ہمارے problem ہیں extremism کے یا جو issues چلے آ رہے ہیں terrorism کے 9-11 کے بعد سے یا پہلے سے اس کو کیسے ہم فائٹ کر سکتے ہیں ایدی کولیشن تو میرے ساتھ بھی یہ بڑا اچھا موف تھا اور اس کو ختم کرنے کے لیے جو ہم نے اس کے ریزلٹ دیکھے ہیں وہ سامنے ہی ہیں اور پاکستان امریکن کو آگے بڑھنے کے لیے ہمیں اوپن ہارٹڈلی بڑے with a forward thinking in a civil manner try to promote the relationship so that پاکستان آگے بڑھے ابھی میں سمجھتا ہوں کہ time difficult ہے global problems چل رہی ہیں